happy about the trucks here, but I guess we're gonna see what he says here in a minute. Hey, what's going on guys? Right now we're currently headed towards my unload and I don't know if you can tell where I'm at right now, but as you can guess, due to the traffic, I'm actually in Atlanta and right now I'm headed to a store with parking. I'm gonna stay there for the night and we'll do the unload the following day. So we're gonna be doing the unload at this warehouse in Alabama and I actually wanted to show you guys how it looks to unload a shipment from my trailer. It's gonna be pretty easy since we're going into the warehouse, but it is about 6,500 pounds of furniture and boxes. So I would consider that about a medium sized job. I'm just gonna do it with one other person. So I do assume that it'll take around four to five hours, but we'll see exactly how long it takes when we get to it. I'm just trying to creep through here. I gotta say guys, this place is known for people jumping out in front of you or they'll switch their exits at the last minute. You really just never know what to expect over here. So you just gotta expect the unexpected so that you can drive safely. So right now we're only about 10 minutes from where I'm gonna park for the night. So once I get through all this traffic, we'll be good. And I'm planning to explore around the area a little bit, see what kind of food that we can get. We're almost through it guys, only a bit longer. We're literally only like two miles from our destination, but as you can see, it's gonna be a very slow two miles, but at least we're making progress and it's not completely stopped because I've definitely been in that position too. Stuck back in it, spoke too soon. Should've just stayed quiet. Our ex is right there, but there's no telling when we're actually gonna take him. All right guys, so we're finally at the light of the exit and the store is literally right up that way. So not too much longer to go. So we're gonna try to figure out the best way to get in, but that's where we're going is over there. It's called Buford Highway Farmers Market. And obviously we can't go in that way. It's a little too tight and that looks steep. So we're just gonna cut over here to this light and we should be able to go around back. Try to cut into this back entrance over here. Should be more space since this is typically where the trucks go to unload groceries and whatnot. I'm just hoping that another semi truck doesn't come through this way because we will both not fit and one of us is gonna have to back up. And it looks pretty tight back there around that turn. Oh, well, it's not too bad actually. I don't know guys, maybe we can't park here. They're looking a little weird right now. Looks like this truck driver's parked here and they don't look too happy. So we might have to figure out something else. Seems like the business must have told them to move. They're not happy about the trucks here, but I guess we're gonna see what he says here in a minute. All right, so I just spoke with the police officer and he was just saying that they used to allow truck parking here, but now you can see there's a sign that actually says no tractor trailer parking and you will get towed at the owner's expense. So we can no longer park here, guys. So we're gonna go find somewhere else to park. And the police officer was telling me that there's a QT with a little bit of truck parking there. So we're gonna go try that out first and see how it is. They actually have another sign right there as well. But yeah, guys, so that's where we would have been staying. Would have had a Waffle House right here. 
Look at that dinosaur right now, man. What is it doing? Yo, there's a whole dinosaur right here, bro. I forgot we're in Atlanta, man. Anything's possible. What the? That's crazy. So that's actually all the traffic that we just came out of earlier. And hopefully it doesn't spit us into more, but I think we're gonna be okay. And we only have about about a mile, a little bit less to go. All right guys, so here it is. Let's hope I can get some truck parking. All right, so like I figured, there wouldn't be much parking at a QT and if there is any parking, but I thought I would at least pass it and give it a chance on my way over to this other agency and I should be able to park there for sure. So we'll go check that out. All right, so now we're about to pull up to the agency. Hopefully they're still parking there, which there should be. I would have just came here from the start, but it wasn't exactly along my route, but it's also not too far out of my route. So it's not like a huge deal, but the important part is that we're gonna find some parking all right guys we made it let's cross our fingers that there's an available parking space in the back right now it's honestly not looking good right now all right thankfully we got one right there because that was the last spot here actually so Guys, I really struggle trying to back in an automatic truck. I haven't got it down yet. I feel like it just keeps going a little and then I try to let out the gas so I don't go too quick. Then it stops and it's so jerky. I'm trying to get better at feathering the pedal so that way it's not as jerky, but like I said, I guess it's just gonna take me a little bit more time to get used to it. So we're gonna stay here for the night and I'm gonna get my things together so that we can get ready for that unload. But yeah, so I'll catch you guys on the road once we're heading back towards Alabama and we'll go from there. All right guys, so we just made it over here to the warehouse in Alabama. We're about to unload the 7,000 pounds. We're gonna take it over there to Dodge 5. And I'm gonna go ahead and rip the U-turn right here so we can get adjusted for the backing. guys we're gonna put the suspension down that way it takes some of the additional wear and tear off of one of those tires back there and I don't eat through both of them so fast we're gonna make this u-turn right here
So we're officially done and offloaded. Just got my last three-way right now. And now we're about to go to the next one. Get stationed at a truck stop, get some rest. Catch you guys in the next video.